Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. It's Monday. It's Ladder Leverage Day, and we got Mr. Beardy Bog with us. How are we doing today, Hello. sir? Uh, pretty, pretty awesome. You know, just um, happy, happy to be here as, as always. Yeah, we always have a good time, man. Um, so we, we, you wanted to play some Colgrim. I said I haven't played it, so we're gonna we jammed. Uh, we jammed some games, but we had I had a technical difficulty, and some of the the games got messed up. So. Uh, short video today, but um, I think yeah, uh, we want all the games, right? Yeah, <laughs> it, we, we the, smoked them. Um, the, yeah, that's the sad part, right? But um, um, I think though this one it shows like something that where it's like, like you said, it's the hard counter to it, and we still were able to come through, which I think is yes, always a good thing. Yes. Um, but to be fair, I think that's um, mostly our opponent misplaying, right? Then. Um, deck just like straight up winning to be honest yeah you'll see what happens uh, in the in it's, the it's not like super super big misplay i just think like they always uh win long round right because uh of burden right but that's that's the only like you know uh, major misplay to be honest right um so you know going through the list you know there is the possibility of some some bricks here and I was telling Beardy and that... And by possibility, yeah. like, a brick stick, right? Yeah. Uh, I, I, I said it kind of reminds me of Lippy on how the deck plays. You want to try to find the... The portal is basically like your series. You know, you want to get that out and get your huge thinning, you know, going. Yes, yes. Because it works both ways. It uh, clogs opponent's uh, deck and thins yours, right? So portal is uh, the... I guess, like, biggest piece of this deck, apart from, like, uh, Colgrim shenanigans, right? Yeah, so make um, sure you don't you don't brick your four P cards. Um, you got to be yes. wary of. Uh, you have to mulligan aggressively and still not no brick. That's basically. Yeah, so the... it's 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 casino. It's a casino friend. Is as yes, Spiro but says. if you're feeling like risky, <laughs> risky, and you know like ballsy, you should definitely try it out. It it, it does you know feel satisfying when you get your Colgrim to twenty plus, right? Right. It, it just you know feels feels right. Yeah. Um, and then, uh, you know, a couple other things too, you know, Cynthia, a really great card. You can put that card on top and then play your Mata and then you know what card they draw, which is really nice. Um, the only way you're really getting the hunting pack out is either the bleeding from the Witcher or your Ox, right? No, you know? they usually, they usually have, um, a stratagem which gives, uh, uh, Veil, so you just give it, get it for free. Yeah, that's Usually true. When that's you know that true. Point, so it's it's really not um, not that bad. Also, there's like one cheek interaction which I forgot to mention when we played. But if you guys, if you have a brick portal, you can still play it and then just play uh, a Sire and shuffle back a four P unit. Uh, yeah, the card that you it. lost. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I think like that card for seven P is like pretty good. It can be like uh, obviously like nine for seven, but you can also shuffle back. Uh, I don't know, like a garbage card in opponent's deck, which also gives like plus two. Yeah, uh, lamp, to give them the green. lamp gin. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> lamp, lamp, lamp gins are pretty, pretty good cards for sure, for sure. Yeah. Um, there's also like some considerations. You could uh, run um, the 4P um, Witcher, which keeps boosting by one uh, instead of um, Nausicaa's. The right? adapts, right? Yeah. I just think like uh, Sergeants are slightly better and they're definitely better in a mirror, right? Right. Um, because yeah, like mirrors uh, with Colgrims, they just they are just like probably most atrocious gameplay you can see. Uh, <laughs> right yeah, now. it's just like you play three point guard, I play three point <laughs> yeah. guard. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty garbage. Um, any other considerations? Like you can uh, definitely fit uh, whatever you want um, in that matter slot. Um, you can potentially run um, King Slayer as well. Um, which I don't think is correct because Colgrim is at uh, adrenaline um, one, right? Yeah. Which is uh, rather rather hard uh, to um, get by, so. but potentially yeah. he's standing. Yeah. yeah, but potentially he's always always uh, there, right? And uh, one more thing, guys. Like uh, Vigo is like really high roller here. Like we hit like um, mentor every time, but it's really it doesn't it doesn't happen that way. It doesn't happen that way. So usually you want to play him uh, when uh, both uh, mentor and hunty pack is um, a valid options, right? Those are like your two main, main targets, right? Right. So he rarely misses both, but um, when when you want to hit that mentor for sweet sweet thirteen points, and instead you get like a one point uh, engine, you are like, yep, 
and it's not exactly what they wanted to find. Right. You can like, um, you know, minimize um, the outcome by, uh, let's say, like even kicking sergeants all together and just having a single target for rather two for portal. But I just don't think it's correct. Mm -hmm. I just don't think it's That's... correct because the deck is just um, mega high rolly. Yeah, and, and it thin it thins so well that like if you do brick that, like you're gonna be in big trouble. Yes, exactly. The, 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 that's that's a very good point. If you brick, uh, the problem is not gonna go away. You're just gonna. No. Uh -uh. <laughs> yeah, especially on a, a deck that wants to push, you know, like uh, elves yes. or you know AQ or something like that, where they are, they're gonna put the screws. Yeah. So, to you. so for for instance, um, I think I think your optimum hand is like four card round three. I think four cards is uh, ideal. I think. Um, but yeah, we, we don't really have uh, much control because you you kind of want to use quoted weapons to um, clog opponent rather than control. Sometimes it works both ways if the engine is you know like I don't know some like elven dude right. But that's the reason why we uh, have um, this leader to just give like a bit of control. I think like leader is uh, pretty solid with his deck yeah. because it um, just you know gives you some sort of control which we don't really have with. Uh, let's say, a tactical decision, which is the best leader for this sort of deck, even mm. though few people actually play it, right? Right. Yeah, and but you, also you get you that sweet imprisonment players. contract, too, you know what I mean? It's like, yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you start jamming yeah, it, yeah. wow, it'll pop, it'll pop. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I think, like, other cards are fine. Geralt Quine is another thinning card, which uh, gives shield sometimes, right? Like, shield is uh, sometimes pretty big. Um... Oh, yeah, especially and, uh, on the traps and stuff, you know. Yes, exactly, going. exactly, exactly, exactly. So I think I think uh, other cards are, like, pretty much set in stone, right? Like, you have to play uh, Nickets and Roach. Uh, location is a great, great card. Um, we have inclusion of Orcs. I think, like, all uh, locks have been buffed. And again, like, it's another, uh, you know, con control. Uh, instead of Orcs, you could play uh, Baranga. I was playing Baranga. But uh, he just plays so massively into Turgby which like, I found very, very annoying. And sometimes like you don't even have enough witches. Like you don't really want to drop a uh, uh, mantle prior to, you know, uh, ensuring he has like fucking 11 points or something, right? And then right. You, you, your guy just dies. But Berenga is definitely an option. We have enough, uh, enough witches, yeah. I think. Yeah, I think, it's, uh, I think it functions pretty well. It should be able to level you up if you're still trying to make that push before uh, april fool's day so uh, yeah, deck list yeah. will be in the comments um once again beardy thank you so much for recording dude we we thank appreciate you, you man you. we had we had some fun i uh yes as always as always yeah. and i'm hoping to uh be your guest for your number you know uh 100 uh, show yeah as well, right? I, I i think we'll try and do like a jam session Multiple. see if yeah, yeah, see yeah. if we can get yeah. you know like green knight and a couple of the other guys yes. mr gray yes. that, that, that that would be that would be pretty pretty <laughs> awesome yeah, yeah and so. and probably play some you know sort of like uh you know demo deck i think that would be the way the warrior in my yeah. opinion right yeah that's stockpile good. stockpile is just like it needs some love, <laughs> needs some love. <laughs> maybe maybe we'll jam the revenants if it's still still viable here. Yeah, yeah, Re revenants, uh, revenants are pretty fun. I think they're they're viable in hands of Vimon. That's my opinion, right? He's, 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 uh, Be one with he's, the pile. Uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Gotta love him or hate him, but yeah, he no, always lives. I don't, I don't know anybody. Sure. Dude. He's 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 pretty wholesome. I will say though that he was was it his uh, games that he Spiro was watching and the games just completely disappeared when he was trying to cast oh really <laughs> yeah they they don't use twitch they use some other website ah uh, no 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 um that's that's a chinese um streaming platform right uh uh hua hua or something like that right oh it was horrible it went from like yeah, yeah, 30p yeah, yeah. and then it just completely disappeared and then the games were yeah. over <laughs> like, holy yeah, shit but yeah. But yeah, oh, um, yeah, Bible is great. yeah. Um, but uh, short video today, we've got a game for you. Um, like always, thank you guys so much for everything. Um, we'll see you guys at the end. Yep, stream. Perfect. Well, these clogs will be fun, yeah. But he play, they usually play Earthen, right? So it's pretty terrible matchup. <laughs> 
All right, so we have uh, very good draws. Yeah. So we drop a um, hunting pack. Yep. And Nekos and don't find the 4P card. Okay, we have to stick. So we just start with portal? Yes, yes we do. Place a wrong dive with the uh, roach which I really love. Melee is getting full. Yep. So the other one for sure is the infiltrator. Um, okay, I mean... It's, it's fine. So, can you check uh, what's, um... What's Mata pulling? Just like a random 9. We can't eat the target yeah. or defender, right? Uh, they're both actually pretty bad. Alright, I guess we play a... Uh, second 4 Picard, doesn't matter which one, really. Oh. Uh, probably shouldn't throw stack because of last rate if he has it. Yeah. They normally don't, but... I guess you play Hunt back next to proc the things. Right. Out of like, uh, 4p range because uh, Infiltrator doesn't proc them. Hmm. Yeah. That's pretty bad news. That card is really great. Oh. So we still do pack? Back row. Flip. Yeah. I always find a way. Want to maximize the chances? Uh, bleeding doesn't go to uh, infiltrator. Okay, now we play the second guy. If not by strength, then we start fogging. It's gonna be pretty tough to win this round. Well, yeah, he gets. It's just like I think that's probably the worst matchup out of Metadex. Even Iced is like um, okay if you can. They just SK just can't uh, go super deep round one. I think that's the main weakness. Um, and then they can't deal with defender right. And no Mokvag is pretty huge. Most of us cut cut Mokvag. But this list is uh, pretty, pretty heavy. Blue, red, I think it doesn't really matter. Like, you, you can clog them, right? But if they have um, Triss and what's the name? Uh, Eden or Nero, you just lose. Then again, we. Okay. Triss is. So we're getting big. big stuff out of them. That's good. Wait. That overfills, uh, doesn't it? Yep. I mean, I guess he's gonna start dropping oh. talismans for fucking billion points, but yeah, we have to keep going, so uh, use Wiper Witcher on the 5 point uh, What's better than a drone, dead noble? so you don't give him space, and obviously, value bleeding. Right. Yep. Um, go again. Your life was worth a great deal, my lord. Take comfort in that. Yeah. There's another talisman uh, we have to pass. It's pretty, pretty bad. Yeah, he just... All that. All that. So we're out. Yep. Does he go for the 2-0? Uh, I don't think he can go for two, honestly. But the problem is, um, like, he probably has like Erden or, I mean, yeah, probably Erden. Like the list from tournament and like just in general runs Erden. So this is just like a do matchup, I think. Um, so is Cynthia guaranteed? Should be right. No. And then one of three. Did we just drop the Colgrim? Yeah, sure. We get it with the... Uh... That doesn't do anything, so not again that. There it is. Oh, nice, nice. Now oh, he's gonna bleed. 
Uh, I think that's the way you lose, honestly. Ah, uh, he has a Nero. That really sucks. Okay, that's really good for us because this means uh, he can't deny um, Golem. Good. So we go front row and just give him. Uh... Well, we don't want to give many of those, huh? No, no, no. I would, I would actually use um, a Sire to get the head right. Then we can stop. So we're just stopping. taking the knickers, huh? Or the roach? No, no, no. Uh, roach. Like, knickers doesn't necessarily have to come off. Ah, it's real annoying. He drew on Nero as well. The gigs. He does spell Triss though. Uh, Triss Talisman, one of the dudes. So at max he has two more, which is still pretty huge, I guess. So this is Whispers, yeah. So what does he go with? Uh, the, yeah, this one. Alright, we have to play um, Cynthia because we're gonna play Mata next, probably. It's just like, you don't even have block targets, right? Like, Lida is pretty garbage against this, yeah. this deck, so everything is really, really bad. To be fair, like, any other NG Lida is pretty bad against this Lida as well. Just They just play wide instead of tall. I guess that's exception to rule, but... So that's a 6 point card. So do we screw over his Behemoth? Because he wants to go Behemoth. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I would actually just play uh, uh, Mata, see what we get, and then if he plays Golem, then we copy Golem with uh, Geralt, folk to one another. Okay. Ah. Uh, no Geralt uh, location. Because if he plays like a 3 point card right now, it, it doesn't really threaten us, and he already played most of his swarm, right? True. He can't play um, Andraga X or whatever it's called because we're just gonna lock it. So I think he doesn't have much storm left. Okay, this behemoth is set. Maybe it's uh, Glass T Kappa, please. Uh, nobody runs Glass T. Oh, it's just this. Okay, that's hot points. There'll be nothing to pick up when I'm done with you. Alright. So, what is. Uh, the guy pulling. What guy? Oh, uh, Roderick? Yeah. It's either Vigo oh. or Fifon. Mm -hmm. I think we just drop uh, that ox and then we lose the game. Sometimes I've had about <laughs> Pretty much. Does this he just 2 like, us uh, or? I think, I think if he doesn't to us, we win, but... So we go... Location, or do we just... Go with Vigo? Oh, we can't go, he's only two now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's, that's the problem. So we know that he has a golem in hand, right? Um... Yeah, I think we play um, defender with uh, our guy and then try to take it with a uh, double double uh, mentor. Yeah, yeah, that's a good play. But I feel like it's not defender. Yes, Vigo is useless right now. Uh, front row. Yeah, you asked in the beginning uh, video, like, what's the worst matchup? I think it's this one. I think this is the worst one. And then you would assume. Okay. Right, so we play um, our location dude. Uh, probably front row as well to dodge. The... Wait. Who do we pick? This? Uh, Mentor, yeah. Strike first and strike Not hard. Bad. Yeah. But he still has. Nero, yeah. 
Uh, so this is playing for 13 points plus 6. Do we have enough? 48. No, it's never enough. Um, is it enough with the Colgrim? So let's shuffle back something first. Um, everything is good, though. It's a problem. Predatory dive? No, that kills No, us no, we don't have proactive. Uh, yeah, um, I think you just shuffle, uh, like, Talisman. And then what are we playing? Uh, I guess, like, Holgrim. Because uh, I don't think any card is enough. To clear my name and restore my uh, so we get, like, plus... Oh, it's always enough. What am I saying? Yeah, it's always <laughs> enough. Nice. All right. So, Twenty-one point card. <laughs> yeah, not bad. Yeah. So I mean, we get two manners, hopefully, maybe three. Yep. But uh, we don't have like proactive play. That's not true. Have to mulligan. The, um, we don't have witches. Have to oh. mulligan mentor. Huh. He's got the... Uh, yeah, I think I think we roll for Vigo, because even if you get um, Sergeant, it's like somewhat okay. The senses can be but I guess like, uh, Manta is always more points, unless you hit uh, Golden, then it's zero point play. Monsters! No, okay. a goal will suffice for now. So, so. I mean, it's still nine. You you high rolled uh, every Vigo so, so far. far. <laughs> Squirrel, that's good. Okay, it's really good for us. Okay, so we just uh, play the coated weapons on it. Oh. Okay, okay, we might have a chance actually no to play the guy back row. But he has a Nero to deal with one guy, right? No, he has a Nero. Focus on it. We just lock that Find now. The noise in your head. Yeah. So Nero what? Wait, he played that Oh, I thought it was melee lock, I don't know why. Um, yeah, it's, it's, uh, I guess I guess they have to keep playing uh, everything um, front row because Triss is uh, also range ro uh, locked, right? And uh, tribute, so they can't play shit. Um, yeah, I guess you play a guy front row, but it doesn't matter. He has like Erden. And yeah, I'm just an of your will. Fucking Erden. If he didn't find a hero, maybe we had a chance. But... So, so. Oh, he has it because it came back to him. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I know. Do we still win uh, that? Is there enough? Yeah, I think we do. Yeah. <laughs> and plus five plus one. Yeah, we win. Right. Two plus ten, twelve plus seventeen plus one, eighteen. Twenty-six. <laughs> yeah, I think you were right on the bleed. I think the bleed was incorrect. <laughs> yeah, that was that was pretty bad. But but this is definitely the toughest matchup. Yeah, that was a good good showcase. Well, we get to do it again, Mr. Beardy Bog. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> thanks for recording, sir. We had some technical yes, difficulties, yes, yes. like always. I think we 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 were supposed to win uh, the previous game as well, honestly. So the deck is unbeatable. What yeah. do what do what do you think, uh, Mr. Uh, I, I I like I, it. I I I didn't play. This is. My actual first time playing Colgrim. I, I I usually avoid playing decks like that are just everywhere off the bat, like Vi yeah, and yeah, stuff. Yeah, but this is but this is like really off meta now, right? So that's yeah, how, you know, yeah. I thought it was I thought it was an okay time to to sneak it in here. Plus, everybody loves our great son here. So yes, yes, that's... yes, exactly. But if you look at like uh, round two of this game, Colgrim was twenty one point play, right? So like they're just like one is the round and. That's one was the game, right? Because we save all the mantles, right? So right. I think I think um, the card is definitely packing lots of juice, even mm. uh, with nerf, right? Which is pretty big, pretty big. It's like a huge, huge nerf. Yeah, absolutely awesome creation, sir. 
um <laughs> thanks for recording we appreciate you man uh, always a good time um yep thank you guys so much for watching you probably uh met a snapshot sometime this week i would imagine since uh, everybody's done yes, with uh I would, I would imagine with the qualifiers right yeah there might be uh, something off of there that pops in maybe maya mon's rev revenants or something yeah you know. I, I would hope so i kind of want to jam that deck i'm uh, not gonna lie yeah we'll have some we'll have some fun with it but um thank you guys so much for watching we'll see you next yep. time bye-bye all right